Send up smoke and we'll be right with you, folks. Bronco Airlines. Seriously? Guess so. So, find anything? Yeah, we gotta send up smoke. Like, with a fire? Wait, you've never heard of smoke signals? Wow. What do they teach you in Midgar? Enough. <laughs> well, leave it to someone who knows more than just enough. This is taking too long. But I can speed things up. <laughs> Come to me, airplane! Follow the smoke! Come to, Come me. to me, airplane! airplane. Follow, Follow the smoke! The smoke. <laughs> well, I'll be there. Told you I'd speed things up. <laughs> Over here! <laughs> Bravo, sir! Two folks. Cosmo Canyon, please. Good. You talk? The hell kind of magic trick is this? <clears throat> uh, not that I ain't seen crazier shit on my travels. Now, how many of you we got? Uh, too many. But, the old girl likes a challenge. <laughs> <laughs> With hazard pay, I'd say this is fair. And since I don't have much else going on, I'll be here scratching my ass to y'all pony up. Much obliged. Hop on board and sit where I tell you. Got to make sure my baby's balanced just so. <laughs> Hold on tight now, you hear? Fall out and you're on your own. Because... <laughs> Here we go! Soldier, my boy. I'd hold still if I were you. We wouldn't want any complications. No, Professor. <laughs> Since you're so committed, I'm going to give you a special treatment. One that will surely make you into a hero. Once, this would have taken years. But now, now it takes a mere 18 hours. All thanks to me and my singular genius. I stand at the forefront of science, my brilliance a guiding light. Of course, we pioneers must be ready to do what others are not. Though even I wouldn't dare attempt to improve upon perfection. 